mga katropa, ang mga kasama ko ngayong gabi ay masasabi natin, ito yung mga iniidolo or tinitingala ng mga junior officers, mga katulad ko, at ng mga kasundaluhang babae. Alamin po natin, ano ba ang mga success principles nila para naman makuha namin so that we could also achieve the same level of accomplishment. Ma'am, sa inyo. Well, uh, sa akin, ano, itong palay kong sinasabi, determination, dedication, and discipline. So, determination on what you want to achieve, dedication to the service that you, kung saan ka na nabilong, and of course, discipline. Sa demand ng trabaho natin, we have to upkeep lagi yung sarili natin para hindi ka nahuhuli o kaya na nakakapag-comply ka doon sa demands ng trabaho. So, yun lang yung tatlo sa akin. Ako naman is, ano, um, first ko talaga is putting God in everything you do. Kasi, alam naman natin na we can't do nothing without the ano, intervention of our, ano, diba, our God. So, just pray first before you go to your work. Then, you ask wisdom. Kasi hindi naman natin kaya ang lahat kung wala yung, ano, yung wisdom na ibibigay ni God sa atin. Then, of course, we will ano, um, always uh, accept whatever yung mga gustong ipa ipagawa sa atin. Of course, sometimes i-ano rin natin siya, i-evaluate din natin before before natin siya gawin. Pero siguro naman sa ano natin is talagang wala naman silang ipapagawa sa atin ng hindi ano, hindi maganda, di ba? So, uh, we will always submit to authority. Lalong-lalong na sa mga ano natin, sa mga boss natin or sa mga senior officers natin. Okay, uh, I agree with uh, ma'am uh, that uh, in everything you do is uh, we live up to our Lord. So, uh, ako, uh, doon talaga ako uh, nagdi-depend for the wisdom and the strength. Uh, for my, ano, for my uh, 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 secret of uh, being a successful uh, uh, female uh, military officer is that uh, I always believe in, ano, in the commitment. If you, uh, if you uh, show your commitment to, you, to what you do, and the, the, and and your passion in doing that uh succeed ka and plus uh in sa, sa military kasi uh we are bounded by so many uh rules of law guidelines policies protocols and everything so lahat is uh, uh we are guided by those policies and obedience to those policies is very very important so uh sa akin uh the character or the attitude is uh, number one. Sabi nga nila, even if you are the most brilliant uh, officer, but uh, if you don't have the, the character or the attitude, uh, wala ka rin uh, patutunguhan. So, yun yung naging, ano ko, yun yung naging uh, guide ko. Na I have to, ano, and, and I always inculcate to my juniors that uh, 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 the character is very, very, very important. We can always teach uh, the skills, the knowledge, but uh, the attitude, uh, it's very, very hard to, ano, to teach them. So, yun yung, ano, yun yung nagiging uh, uh, ano ba to? instrument in achieving this, uh, for uh, reaching what I am, I am now. The, the experiences that I have in the military, actually, the discipline, <coughs> the military professional professionalism that was uh, inculcated in, in me yun yung naging ano ko naging uh, instrument ko in for being a successful uh, female uh, military officer ang 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 secret i, I i'm not sure if it's really a secret but for me the key to a success is loving your work you love your work, it loves you back. And yun talaga yung naging, yun talaga yung naging drive ko. Um, kahit saan mo ako ilagay na opisina, it might give me the hardest job or the, the most relaxing job. 
Pero at the end of the day, I always I always love my work. I love the people around me. Kasi um, I, I realize that when you begin to appreciate the things that you do, and when you begin to appreciate the people around you, they tend to to live up to your expectations. And you tend to live up to the expectations also of your bosses. Itong mga boss natin, um, Uh, nakikita nila yung mga ano eh, tama yung sinabi ni Ma'am eh. Nakikita nila kung sino-sino yung mga officers na nandiyan yung tamang puso para sa trabaho. And I always make it a point, kasi nasa finance ako, I always make it a point na at the start of the day, iniisip ko, sino ba ang customer ko? Sino ba ang beneficiary ng tinatrabaho ko? Para kanino ba tong ginagawa ko for today? And it, it gives me focus, it gives me direction, it gives me inspiration na kaya kong tulungan ang mga tao na to. Kaya kong, kaya kong mag-extra effort para sa kanila. Because um, masaya ako when I do these things. It makes me happy, it makes me fulfilled.